Let's create pixel stretch effect in Adobe Photoshop. I have kept my document size to 1920 by 1080 pixels with a resolution of 300. So let's get started by adding an image. Go to File and click on Place Embedded. You can find the link of this image in the description below. Now place it to the right side of the canvas. Click Enter to confirm. Go to Layers and right click on the layer. Click on Rasterize Layer. Now select the Rectangle Marquee Tool and make a selection like this. We are going to use Content Aware Fill to fill this area. There are two methods of doing this. You can either right click and then select Content Aware Fill or select it through the contextual taskbar. Once it's done, press Ctrl plus D to deselect the selection. Now, left click and drag the layer to the plus icon to make a copy. We'll create one more copy of it. Let's rename them as Mask Effect and Base. Select Mask Layer and scroll down here to get the Select Subject option. You can find the same option in the contextual taskbar. Let's select the Quick Selection tool and select the remaining objects. Use Close Bracket to increase an open bracket to decrease the size of the brush. Left click to make a selection. Hold Alt and left click to delete selection. Do the same with the remaining objects. Once everything is done selecting, create a mask by clicking this icon. So if we hide these two layers, we can only see our subject. Select the effect layer. Now let's zoom in using scroll wheel. Select the rectangle marquee tool and make a thin vertical selection like this. Press Ctrl plus T to get the transform tool. Press Ctrl plus zero to set the canvas as fit to screen. Now drag it to the left side. Press Enter to confirm and Ctrl plus D to deselect. Do the same for others just like this. Now using the marquee tool, make a selection like this right around the stretcher. Make sure you don't select any of the background. Also make sure you leave some gap on the right side. Then press Ctrl plus C to copy and Ctrl plus V to paste. Now select the effect layer again and repeat the same process for the other pixel stretched areas. Press V to get the Move tool. Click on the layer to select it. Press Ctrl plus T to hit the Transform tool. Click on this warp icon. By holding spacebar and left click, we can move the canvas. As you can see, these nodes here, left click and drag them. Place it as you want. It might take some time to get a hang of the warp tool, so have patience. Press Enter to confirm and do the same with the rest of the layers. Once done, select the effect layer. Then let's get the eraser tool and start erasing the extra parts. Now click on mask layer and click on the plus icon to create a new empty layer. Select the pen tool and draw a shape like this by using only three points.
right-click on the blue line and click on Make Selection. After that, select the Brush Tool. Use Close Bracket to increase an open bracket to decrease the size of the brush. Hold Alt and click to select dark color from that area. Now give small strokes like this to give a shadow effect. We'll do the same to this one. And we are done. Hope you liked the tutorial. Hope you got to learn something new. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial.